is likely going to be another day of frustrations for people in the Carrollton and Uptown area. On day one, it was the water, heavy flooding from the broken water main turned streets into rivers. And on day two, there were construction crews, boil water advisories, and in some cases, no water. So, what can people expect on this the third day? Bill Capo joins us live from Carrollton with more. Bill? You just want to make me give all the bad news. I know what y'all are doing here. The hole still back there, 30-inch water main that broke on Tuesday, uh, is at the bottom of that hole. The Sewage Water Board tried to repair it last night to put a clamp around the thing. Clamp didn't fit in the process. This area lost water. People were not happy. They're coming back out this morning. We're starting to see a little bit of activity here. There's also an AT&T box uh, down there that uh, got affected by the flood. They're trying to fix that. Sewage and Water Board crew's coming back, but they won't start the work until after 9 o'clock to let people get up and get their showers, breakfast, and all of that, because there is the chance while they try to make the final repairs of the pipe that once again, water pressure could be either low or no pressure for a while out here, but they say the repairs today should go quickly. We'll be here for it. Reporting live, I'm Bill Campo, Eyewitness News. All right, thank you, Bill. Well, there are a lot of questions.